Sound. How are sounds made? Words to learn. Control variable. The source of sound will be the same throughout your investigation. This is your control variable. Dependent variable. The loudness of the sound is called dependent variable. Independent variable. When sound travels through four or five different materials, one will be air, which is gas, at least one will be a liquid and at least one will be a solid. Vibrate. It means to move continuously and rapidly to and fro. Vibration. Vibration is a periodic back and forth motion of the particles of an elastic body or medium. What is the source of sound in this picture? It's the aeroplane. As the aeroplane flies higher into the air, will Zara be able to hear it? No, she cannot hear it. Copy the sentence and choose the correct word to finish it. A sound travels further from a source. It becomes stronger or fainter. It's fainter. Identify sources of sound in the classroom. Look at the photograph of birds singing. We hear the bird's song with our ears. How does a sound travel from a source to our ears? Vibrations cause sound. Sounds are made when things vibrate. A vibration is a very quick movement back and forth. You often cannot see vibrations, but we can feel them. Hold your hand on your throat and hum a tune. You'll be able to feel the vibrations and hear the sound. You can see these guitar strings vibrate when you plug them. Think like a scientist. Investigate how well sounds travel through different materials. For this investigation, you need to choose a source of sound. It could be a buzzer, a bell, or a ticking clock. A source of sound will be the same throughout your investigation. This is your control variable. Now you can test how well sounds travel to four or five different materials. One will be air, which is gas. At least one will be a liquid and at least one will be a solid. These are the things that you change. These are called independent variables. In the first picture, sound travels through a gas. In the second, sound travels through liquid. Third, sound travels through a solid. This is an activity where you can work with a partner. One of you can make a sound. The other partner can listen to how loud the sound is through different materials. The loudness of the sound is called dependent variable. This is a variable that you're going to measure. It's called dependent variable because the sound loudness depends on the materials. Your measurements will be different and depend on which material you listen through.